from inside the booth at Highland Park. Triple A baseball on MLB The Show. It's the Scranton Wilkes-Barre Rail Riders taking on the Lehigh Valley Iron Pigs. And down. All right, we'll be back to get this one started after this. All right, ready to get underway. Here's the shortstop at the play. Oswald Peraza. The 2-1. Line drive, caught! Jose Peraza at the plate. This is a guy who's in the lineup first and foremost because of what he contributes defensively, Chris. And when you talk about preventing runs from being scored, this guy is a big contributor. One down, base is empty. That one fouled off. This one popped up. Torres has a beat on it. And puts the squeeze on that one. And there's two down. Two outs, base is empty. Down the third baseman, Philip Evans. The wind of the pitch. Hit pretty well in the air out to center. Puts the squeeze on that one. And that'll end the inning. of the first. Now it's going to be Nick Maton. And a ball in two strikes. Stays alive. Next offering upstairs. The wind and the pitch. Hit on the ground to the right side. He takes it on his own. One gone, bottom half of the first. And here is Herrera. The center fielder. Here's a 1-1. One -one. This one chopped on the ground, but foul. One, two, bottom of the first. The pitch. Got him looking. And two away now. And now, John Andreoli. John Andreoli. Going to count one and two. Two down, nobody on. And a foul ball. He stays alive. Pitch misses. Two balls, two strikes to count with two outs. Right-hander kicks, deals. And now it's three and two. Out to short. Peraza handles the chance. Wide throw pulls him off the bag, and the inning still alive. Runner at first with two away. And now the first baseman, Derek Hall. Next offering is in for a strike. And yeah, the right hater deals. Popped up left side. Peraza under it. He's got it. That is the inning. Welcome back. Leading off, Ronald Guzman. The wide to kick the pitch. Swing and a pop-off in foul ground. And there's one down. No, that was a pitch you got to crush 
unbelievable that he missed it right there. I'm telling you, he is going to be frustrating with himself until his next at bat. No score here in the second. Bounce to the right. Torres gloves it. Gets it to first. Two up, two down. Two outs, space is empty. Now the left fielder, Ryan Lamar. This lineup's going to have to find a way to make him work a little harder out there on the mound. I mean, he is just mowing him down. He's settling in. you got to make... Ah, that ends the inning, so we take a break. We head to the bottom of the second. Here's the left fielder, Josh Stevens. Ball to strike. And that's in for a strike. Herman, he isn't really known as the starting pitcher that's going to get you deep into the start. It's not that he's not capable. He just hasn't proven that he can do it yet. The punch out there and quickly one away in the second. And now Josh Akami. Swing and a miss. And the count one and two. He's got such great stuff. You just don't know from start to start whether it's a potential no-hitter or it's a guy that's only going to give you three or four innings. The 2-2. Two -two. Now fly ball to right center. Florial gliding as he moves to his left. Pulls it down, and there's two gone. But for the most part, with that kind of stuff, you expect him to get to the middle of the ball game. So up next, Will Toppy. Nothing, nothing here in the bottom of the second. In the air, right field. Beltre makes the catch, and that'll do it. Back here at the ballpark, top half of the third inning, here's Ender NCRT. And now the lefty. Good late sink on that fastball. Out of the hand looks so good. And then by the time he gets in the hitting zone, hard to get the barrel to it. Line drive. Oh, look at the stop. And that's a great play for the out. Now it's the right fielder, Michael Beltre. Top of the third, no score. offering misses it's two and two and there's a ball kicks and deals swing and a miss and he got him first two batters retired here in the top of the third now at the plate Rob Brantley that one to first Hall collects he steps on the bag that's the third out. Bottom of the inning. Here's the second baseman, Ronald Torres. The one two stays alive. The wind of the pitch. And fouled off. And a 1-2 again. And a ball count, evens the count. The pitch. And a foul ball. He stays alive. Here comes the pitch. To third. And it gets by him. Well, he really had to battle for that one. Man, that was so fun to watch. Just one of those seeing eye base hits through the infield. He just kind of rolled over on it a little bit, but sometimes those can find a hole and get you a knock. And here is Rafael Marchand. So now one and two. And he deals. Just missed. Really good take, especially with two strikes. Two 
Out to short. Oh, great stop. The throw. Peraza to second, to first, not in time. Great effort there. So the lineup flips over, and now Nick Maton, 0 for 1 so far. Righty delivers. That's inside. The 2 1. Out towards left center. Florial in position. And there's two down. Stepping in, Odubel Herrera. His first at bat was a strikeout. Slow ground ball to the right side. Guzman steps on the bag. Play made. That ends the inning. And welcome back. And the batter will be the shortstop. Oswald Peraza. And the pitch. And a foul ball. 2-2 two -two now. Swings through that, and it's a strikeout. And now one away. Jose Peraza now at the plate. Next pitch is outside. Kicks and fires. And that's outside. The Rail Riders hitless so far in the game. And he walked him. Maybe a little loss of focus on the mound right there. Pretty much gifted him first base with a quick free pass. So digging in, Philip Evans. Lifted in the air, right center field. Torres on the move. Takes it in for the out. No, that's a tough play for the infielder ranging back into the outfield. There's part of him that's saying, hey, where are you at, outfielder? Call me off. But he stayed focused and made a nice catch right there. Next pitch misses. Ball three. Pretty good job on the mound in this one, Singy. It feels like we've seen a lot of off-balance swings. Yeah, which is one free pass, and uh, obviously he's not a big strikeout guy, but... He gets soft contact, and he gets out. Left-hand hitter waits. Got him looking. And that'll do it. Welcome back. Bottom of the fourth. And now here's a speed threat. Outfielder, John Andrioli. And the righty deals. Good eye in that spot. It's good speed at the top of the order here. You want to get it on, see if you can get a stolen base, maybe get around the bases and pick up a run. That one misses in the dirt. The pitch. Swag and a miss. The velocity blasted it right past him. Derek Hall getting ready to hit. One one now. Nope. Outside. A little out front there as he swings through it. And a pitch. On the ground, right side. And that's a base hit. So they get a man aboard with a one out single. Now the left fielder, Josh Stevens. Caught looking his first time up. And a pitch. Good eye right there. And that one fouled off. Oh, that 
Brad drilled him. No chance for a play, and let's hope the righty's not hurt on the mound. Well, that may end up being an at-bat we go back to later on when this game is over. Just a cookie down the middle. I mean, those are the ones you dream about. The ones in the cage, you're just hoping you get in the ball game. Right down the middle, not a whole lot of velocity right on top of it. Now, here is Josh Akami. Up the middle. Here's one. What a double play that was. Inning over. We go to the top of the fifth. And now the center fielder, Esteban Florial. The next pitch misses. And that's ball two. And now the lefty. And he grounds one to the right side. The flip to the pitcher covering. And the leadoff man set down in their half of the fifth. Well, he's doing a nice job of keeping the ball out of the air. Lets the defense work behind him with another ground ball. Good execution. Well, on the mound, very efficient. Able to produce an outcome, it seems like, within the third or fourth pitch of just about every bat. Hit in the air, right field. And that will fall. So a man aboard now with one away. With the way defenders track down balls these days, I mean, both from the infield and in the outfield, there really aren't a lot of base hits on balls hit like that. But there's always a little room back behind the first and second baseman to drop a lawn dart in there, and he found a way. They fired in quickly, so it's first and second with only one away. And the batter now, Michael Beltre. He was a strikeout victim his first time. Next pitch is outside. And here it comes. Rip to first, caught. The tag gets him, and it's a double play to end the inning. We head to the bottom of the fifth. Now, here is Will Toffey. The one, two. Two balls, two strikes. Chases that one out of the zone and one away. Next to hit, Ronald Torres. One for one. He singled the left his first time through. Next offering upstairs. A rare three ball count here. He's been throwing strikes all day. Got to be ready to hit if you're in the box. Out to short. Whips it across. Just got him on that one. Good sinker low in the zone right there and produced exactly what he was looking for. Ball on the ground, nice ground out. The pitch. And a good eye there. The 3 1. Good plate appearance there. Able to take the walk. Pretty easy walk right there. Last pitch wasn't even much to think about. And now the shortstop, Nick Maton. offering his foul back. Cut on and miss. Struck him out. That's the third out. Inning over. Back here at the ballpark. Top of the sixth inning. And now the catcher comes up to hit. Rob Brantley. The 1-1. One, one. Just missed. Two balls, one strike. The 2-1. And it's fouled away. Left-hand batter waits. In the air, out towards right center. Andrioli makes his way towards it. 
And there's one down. Back to the top of the lineup. Now it's the shortstop, Oswald Peraza. And it's filled up. Three and two. The pitch. On the ground, right side. Lays out, but he can't squeeze it. He decides to eat it, and they don't get an out on the play. Jose Peraza, the next to hit. He's 0 for 1. The pitch. That's hard hit on the line. Pereira brings it in. Two down. Here's the third baseman, Philip Evans. Now batting. Third baseman, Philip Evans. Move to first. Peraza dives back in safely. At the belt and fires. That one is upstairs. Well, it's been a very impressive outing so far. His command has been a big part of it. Even when he misses, he misses outside the strike zone, which is exactly what a pitcher wants. 3-1 is on the way. So now two on and two outs. Well, that could be a big walk in this ball game. Moves the go-ahead run into scoring position. So some pressure pitches coming up in this next A-B. Kicks and deals. That's off the mark. Two and one. It's a big opportunity right here, but I love the way he's slowing the game down. He's shrinking his zone, making sure he gets the pitch that he wants to hit. Two outs. A couple of base runners at first and second. Hard hit left side. Fires across the diamond. Third out. the six now the number two hitter Odubel Herrera the two one bounced up the middle tosses to first leadoff man retired in the sixth and stepping in is the speedy John Andreoli the wind of the pitch. In the dirt, ball two. This hitter's looking for a fastball, but I'm not sure he's going to get one. Pitcher doesn't have to challenge him. If he feels better about his off-speed secondary stuff, then stay with it. Foul ball there. Swing and a miss. Struck him out. Now two out. So here's the cleanup hitter, Derek Hall. The wind and the pitch. Hall checks his swing. Appeal down to third. And Matthew Ross right on it, says he held up. Two down, nobody on. Line drive, base hit right field. And that keeps the inning alive. I'm sure he feels really good about that one. Pitch was in and off the plate. So hard to do anything with the pitch in that location, but somehow he got the barrel to it and hit it well. Pretty amazing. Shelby Miller will take over here. Well, at this point in the ball game, we're talking about middle innings, and he need a little length out of this arm coming out of the bullpen. We'll see just how many outs he's able to give his skipper. Josh Steven will hit next. And a 2-1 hammered, but foul. Right-hander kicks, deals. Swing and a ground ball out to short. On to Peraza. That ends the inning. Welcome back. Top of inning number seven. Here's the center fielder, Esteban Florial. Two and one now. There's a strike at the knees. 
And it really looks like these hitters have been in between with their timing today. Good fastball, excellent slider, but they've not been able to commit to one velocity and stay there. And there's a hit. A leadoff single, and the go-ahead run is aboard. Go-ahead run on base. Here's the left fielder, Ryan Lamar. And the pitch. At this point in the game, you cannot issue free passes. He's going to have to challenge this hitter. Hitter's got to be ready to swing it. Swing and a liner foul off to the right. With two strikes. May see some movement over there at first base. Try to stay out of a double play here. Fouled off. He was late. Pickoff throw. And he's back standing. The go-ahead run aboard at first. Nobody out. And that's ripped for a base hit. Coming home. And he's safe at the plate as they take the lead. one nothing. Picks himself up in RBI. Everything was mechanically sound with that swing right there. I mean, that's pretty much what you're wanting to replicate with every rep you take. You want good balance, barrel directly to the baseball, and good long extension after contact out in front of home plate. Man, there are a lot of doubles in a swing like that. Sam Kunra takes over on the mound. He'll try to strand the runner at second. Here is Ender Enciarte, one for two. Next pitch is outside. No outs, runner on second. Next pitch misses outside, and that's ball three. Right through there for a strike. Well, don't expect too many more high fastballs. This is a good sinker ball pitcher, and sometimes they can make mistakes trying to pitch up in the zone. Look for him to stay down around the knees to be effective. Righty to the plate. Fouled off again, and it remains three and two. Right-handed reliever. The other way, and that should be extra bases. Lamar coming home. Oh, the throw is wild. Run comes in from second, and they take a two-run lead. Man, that was a pretty good battle at the play, and I'll tell you, it feels pretty good as a hitter when you grind out a hit like that. Anytime you rip a line drive the other way, you feel really good about what you did at the plate. You trusted your hands, you let the ball travel, and you took the barrel straight to it. That's great work right there. And a one-two. Stays alive. Runner at second, nobody out. Swings through that one, it's a strikeout. And that's the first out. Rob Brantley digs in now. Well, bottom of the order here, Boog, you gotta go right after this guy. As they look to pick up an add-on run, and the number nine guy at the plate. Up the middle. Throws to first. Got him. So two down now. And here is Oswald Peraza. Two outs. And one in scoring position. Next offering is fouled back. runner leads away at second and a foul ball he stays alive and a pitch out towards right center field Andrioli on the move makes the grab on the run and that is that Welcome back. And now it's going to be Josh Akami. Next offering way off right. the plate. And 
this is inside. The pitch. To the right side. Guzman takes it himself, and they get the leadoff hitter in the seventh. Well, a well-thrown slider like that one can be tough to get in the air. Good downward break on that one. The 1-1. And another ball. And the right hater deals. That one fouled off. Two and two. And down on strikes he goes. Two gone. Now it's the second baseman, Ronald Torres. Stays alive. <laughs> On the ground to the left. Dives, but it kicks off his glove. See? Fantastic effort, but that extends the inning. Just barely able to beat that one out. Man, he was giving it his all getting down the line right there. Pretty much did the opposite of what you want to do with the pitch on the outside part of the plate like that. Just ah, threw it by him. A swing and a miss at the fastball to end the inning. Welcome back and a new arm on the mound to start the eighth. Andrew Bellotti. It's his job to keep his team in the game. We go to the eighth. Here's the second baseman, Jose Peraza. And he deals. I got to count two and two. And now the count filled up three and two. Three, two. Swing and a high fly ball out there towards left field. Hauls it in for the out. Just pulled off of it a little bit right there. That front shoulder coming open instead of staying closed. If he does that, he's going to be able to go up the middle the other way with some authority instead of a fly out to left. The count two and one. Tapped at the plate, but it's a foul ball. Here comes a pitch. On the ground, right side. And it gets by him. And next will be the cleanup hitter, Ronald Guzman. Popped up. Snags it on the run. Two away. Maybe caught that one off the end just a little bit. Couldn't quite barrel it up enough to really drive it. Met at first. Esteban Florial now at the plate. And the next pitch is way outside. And the righty deals. Swing and a high fly ball down the left field line, but hooking foul. Two and two. Popped up to the left, into foul ground. Toffee makes the catch, and that'll do it. Back now, new pitcher on the mound as we roll into the bottom of the eighth, Ryan Weber. The offense will need to be ready for the breaking stuff. He's got a great curveball. Out 
to the bottom of the eighth. And now here is Nick Maton. Kicks and fires. Pitching has been pretty dominant in this one, but you got to be careful. Not working with too big a lead. They could get right back in this ball game if you're not careful. And now it's even up. And a pitch. And a swing and a miss. And that's one away as the leadoff man is out in the eighth. And now the center fielder, Odubel Herrera. Righty delivers. Swing and a miss. And the count, one and two. Swings and misses. That's his second strikeout. John Andreoli getting ready to hit. Two, two. Swing and a miss, and he is down on strikes for the third straight at bat. Back here at the ballpark, now the left fielder, Ryan Lamar. The pitch. Falling behind two and one. This one smacked out to left center. No trouble here. Puts it away for the out. And a quick out number one. So now here's the DH. Ender and Ciarte for the fourth time tonight. Here's a 1-1. Fought off foul. Look out! And it hit him. He had him 1-2, and he ends up hitting him with a pitch. So, Boog, if you had to take one for the team, where would you want to get hit? Chris, I think I'd have to say upper hamstring. Left-hand hitter waits. Now fly ball to right center. Herrera under it. Makes the grab for the second out. And at first, and here's the catcher, Rob Brantley. And a 1-1. On the ground, right side. That's out number three. So they bring on the veteran, Zach Britton. And he'll do his best to hang on to this lead. And welcome back. Last chance for the home team. And here is Derek Hall. Next offering misses. And a count two and one. And a pitch. Strike two. Left hand batter waits. And a foul ball. He stays alive. The pitch. This one high in the air to left center. Florial drifts towards it. One away. Josh Steven, the next to hit.
Swing and a miss. Struck him out. And they're down to their last out. At the play, Josh Ackerman. And a foul ball. Two two now. And a swing and a miss, and that is the ball game. Well, a low scoring ball game in this one. Two nothing game, few errors, pretty clean. That's kind of what you want to see in terms of defense and pitching. A couple of runs was all it took to get the W today. Two nothing, your final here in this one. For Chris Singleton and our entire crew, I'm John Chompy saying so long. Thank you.